on the floor. It's just grenades. All grenades. Let's try to throw a singular plank of wood at me. Yeah, I mean, then again, having a plank of wood thrown at you is not, you know, it's not like throwing a toothpick. If you throw a two by four at somebody, it's not gonna feel good. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, I totally trust that with my life. So I have to go into this giant fan of death in order to turn on the giant. I almost said flaming. <laughs> I mean, then again, this thing doesn't need to be flaming to be terrifying. It's a giant fan that could cut you up. It's not, you know, it doesn't need to be any more or less terrifying. Eh, this is gonna hurt. Ow. Major detected. It's fine. I only broke my ankle on a giant piece of uh, steel. Morphine I guess an ivy? It's not ivy. Reinforcement beam. There we go. So now this will spin up slowly, and uh, we will begin to fly. There we go. There's also head crabs that fly up here, I believe as well. Dead head crabs, but still head crabs. I haven't really explained why it will. Okay. I haven't really explained why I haven't uploaded in quite a while. And the main reason why, it's not really a problem of motivation. Like, I, I want to record. But the main problem is I didn't have anything to record. I didn't have any games to record. Or, you know, because this is a Let's Play channel, which you may have, you know, noticed if you're watching this. But. A Let's Play channel without any, you know, games to play is not really a Let's Play channel. I didn't have anything to really play. Or, I mean, I had games, but I didn't have anything that really jumped out at me and screamed for me to play. Not really, really screamed, that'd be terrifying if games screamed at you. But, people with other, uh, YouTube channels will kind of understand when I'm coming out here. Because, uh... Eventually, you might hit a little bit of a snag where you don't have any games to play. But, I saw Black Mesa, so that looks cool. Got it, and, of course, I started left playing it. I also have some other games that I plan to, uh, play. There's also PS4, and the whole PlayStation uh, VR, which will be coming out soon. It's already crazy that it's September. Yep. October 13th is when the PlayStation VR comes out, and when the PlayStation VR does come out, uh, if it allows recording, then I will most likely be recording and uploading footage of the PlayStation VR. Alright, let's go melt a demonic space octopus. Fun. Take radiation. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Thank you. 
something I don't really explain in these videos. These videos are usually about 20 minutes to 30 minutes long, generally. But due to the power of editing, that uh, video, the previous video to this one, was 8 minutes. I've also switched my editor from Lightworks to Adobe Premiere. Which, I will admit, Lightworks is a good program, but I've had a couple of problems with it. If you need a free editor, I still do recommend Lightworks or HitFilm Express Pro 4, and hope these guys weren't dead. So yeah, if you still need a free editor, I still uh, I still recommend Lightworks or HitFilm Express Pro. And, uh, but the main problem I had with Lightworks was the sort of double audio effect, if that makes sense. Where audio would basically play twice, slightly lag behind it. And even though I got rid of one of the audio tracks, therefore making it mono, um, it still didn't work. So for whatever reason, you know, I couldn't find a way to fix that. And Premiere is easier to edit with, personally. Lightworks is a good uh, starting editing program. But after that, I would recommend upgrading to Sony Movie Studio 13 or Adobe Premiere. Both are good editing programs. Did I just break fall on a... Like a hand, I just broke my fall. This elevator isn't terrifying or anything. So it stops there. Let's see, how am I gonna get down? I could just jump in the radioactive death juice. I think I'm gonna have to jump into the radioactive death juice. Burns it, burns it, burns it, burns it, burns. Yeah, it's only, you know, gamma, gamma particles and things. It's fine. So now we're in an airlock. Oh look, more radioactive death juice. Well, this is gonna this fall's gonna hurt. Potential fatal fall. Wait what? And there's a bull squid in there. Hmm. I could try to run in there and throw a grenade and run away. Or I could just shotgun them in the face about, you know, two or three times. Boom. There we go. There we go. There is nothing here. This is my hiding spot. I'm not moving until the situation is drastically improved. Now go away and don't tell anyone I'm here. Shouldn't you be under the desk? Oh, yeah. All right. Well, I just need to press a button. So. Oh. So it turns out if you touch the generator while it's on, it'll kill you. Let's not touch the uh, horribly fast razor blade like generator there and instead just uh, run. What happens if I throw a grenade into the generator? Actually, that's probably not a good idea considering that's how I'm gonna kill the giant this is space octopus. So I'm assuming. Ugh. So I'm assuming this is using the radioactive death juice as a power source. Surely there should be some, I don't know, railings? Right there. Considering there's like, horribly radioactive death juice that kills you in a minute of just being in it. Okay, great, my friend dies. Nope. I regret this. No. I just locked them out. Although there's a bunch of hound eyes waiting for me now, so. And a border dump. Nope, nope. Ow! 
Well, this is the third time I've done this. First I got killed by a generator, then I got killed by a door. This time I'm probably gonna die from, I don't know, a meteor or something. Ugh. Ugh. <sighs> boop boop. Let's try not to get killed by a uh, door this time. Oh, there's two skulls. I'm gonna save here so that I don't have to come back and keep doing that process over and over. Oh, of course. I got the tail of a bull squid. Alright. Now, let's go melt a giant space octopus. No! Yeah. Take two. Ow. Pain. Pain. How does it have you to save me from this? Okay. So I only have six health. Come on. I sure hope there ain't more of those things growing around the base. <sighs> Jenkins is at peace now. I can feel it. This is my little corner, and I'm sticking to it. No, Jenkins is in the blast pit. Just got eaten by a giant space octopus. So, you know. Oh, whoa, okay. So I'm gonna have to jump into the water because the ladder breaks right here. Is this... Is this the thing? I guess it is. It's like anchored into the wall and there's three of them, so... And there's chunks of, like, meat. And, ow. There's fire everywhere and burnt corpses. See the yep. Hopefully I don't have to go into that. I need some help. There we go. Ugh. You know, this stuff looks suspiciously a lot like that stuff. But whatever. Okay, so that will kill me. Well, I'm going to end this episode here, Dragons. If you want to see more, make sure to hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you in the next video.